Hi guys, this is going to be a very fast video. I'm not going to talk about any default, any any solver or create a new graph. I just want to clarify one thing that I I mentioned it in one of in one of my last videos. I don't remember if the previous one or the one before. I think it was the one with the FK solver. So uh, in that video, I was talking about the node distribute rotation and how I avoided it because I thought it would. It was giving me a weird um, behavior when it comes to um, solve in uh, the control space um, rotation, the distribution of the rotation. Well, actually, I asked Epic. I I asked Epic about it, and they very nicely replied to me. And what they did reply does make sense. And this is really uh, some piece of information I was not aware of. And I just wanted to share with you. So basically, um, the, the distribution node, but this is true, what I'm about to say is true for literally everything. In this case, I've noticed it on the distribution, uh, on the distribute node, but it is true for everything. And um, it does make sense. So it's something that we need to, to be aware of when working with, with this. Basically, um, the in, in the control rig, the bones are constantly reset to their initial position during the forward solve, so it's looping, right? And so if I, for example, say, um, get transform control of this object, distribute its rotation across this list, this is the behavior that I get, and this is exactly what it's supposed to do, right? And then last time, um, I was trying to do, to basically, because to me these are, the, the, the problem to me is that in my brain these are transforming a hierarchy and these are transforming a hierarchy so I was like okay let me experiment around and see what I can do instead of using bones I'm using controls which is are exactly in the same position and this is the behavior that I get and I was like uh, I don't know if that's a bug or something it doesn't look like it's supposed to do that but the reason there is a reason behind it and the reason does really does make sense so uh, let me try to repeat this again the, the, the bones are um, constantly like during the forward solve reset to their initial to the initial transform right in, in, but the controls are treated differently and the reason is if if the, the the initial transform for the controls was constantly being reset then the user cannot manipulate them in viewport so really Really, the controls are not meant to be driven by by something in that sense uh, using this kind of this type of nodes. So, you 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 we, we could loop them. We could we could do a get and set transform per cycle, but that that would defeat the purpose. And I only and and this makes perfect sense to me. And actually, I was never planning to to rotate to, to you know to get this behavior on controls. I was just experimenting while I'm learning control rig and understand what's the difference between the transform express in bone space or in control space. Sorry, a transform express as a node type bone or a transform express as a node type control. Same goes with space. You know, we have these three different type of transforms. And I thought that that but the graph is doing different different type of things depending on which type of things you're using which it does make sense and probably there is a lot of optimization happening in there as well so i thought i, I wanted to share this with you but because they were kindly enough to to do to do this so uh, basically it just the, the reason why this is happening and i was getting um the idea that that the in, in the other video i mentioned this rotation, even if I rotate slightly, it looks like it's accumulating. If I select this control, you see it, it looks like it's accumulating. Well, it's actually accumulating because because the current position never gets updated. Otherwise, otherwise this transform you will not be able to move it in space. Instead, for the bone, it does. So the the, the local rotation value, no, the local rotation value does make sense only a brief video to mention this and this once you know this then you can make a lot of informed decision when you're building your graph this is something I didn't know so I checked a lot of the documentation I don't think it's mentioned but I may be wrong so that's it thanks